Hey guys, what's up? Chris here for BeerGeekNation.com. Today we are looking at a brand new release from Carl Strauss Brewing out of San Diego. One of my favorite San Diego brewers. This is their Aurora Hoppy Alice. Well played, by the way. 7% alcohol by volume. It's a self-described San Diego style IPA. Hop this one with Simcoe Mosaic, Amarillo, and Citra hops. And it won the uh, bronze uh, bronze medal at the GABF 2015, which that's that says a lot about an IPA because there's a lot of IPAs that are submitted to the categories. This is going to be a year round for them, which is also awesome. I believe it's going to come in six ounce bottles as well. And like I said, great name. I've heard a lot of beer names with hobby or something like that in them. That's a new one. That's a new one. So well played. Let me get into a glass that you guys know it smells tasty. Give the final version of Carl Strauss Aurora Hoppy Alice. All right, guys, the aroma. Oh, wow. Big dankness, pineapple, a ton of pineapple, peach, mango, just kind of a general citrus fruit, some tropical notes, nice dry breadiness. Just smells absolutely delicious. I right, guess the taste. Cheers. Oh, wow. Oh, I need that. Wow. It's been a long time since I've had a super just clean, refreshing West Coast IPA that's done something different. And this is that beer. It's really cool because usually, you know, when you think of a West Coast IPA, you're thinking dry, citrusy, grapefruity, piney, and that's pretty much it. With this one, they kind of went a little bit of that New England style. I'm definitely getting more of the tropical notes, notes sweeter fruits, pineapple, mango, peach, but it's still living in San Diego. You get a lot, of, I mean, it's incredibly dry, incredibly dry, bone dry. Uh, you're getting, little, you know, that, that citrus fruit, the, pie, the, the orange, grapefruit, pine needle, but that mango, pineapple, sweetness, tropical fruits are definitely there. Great body to this beer, 7% alcohol. Um, it's got a nice feel to it, smooth, so like a soft kind of velvety feel. Goes down way too easy. It's just super clean, refreshing, dank, oniony, garlicky, but still got that tropical vibe. It's got a lot going on, but it all works. Really, really awesome stuff. All right, guys, so the final verdict on the Carl Strauss Aurora Hoppy Alice 7% alcohol by volume. It's going to be available very, very soon, so look at it. Look out for it year-round, guys. This is an awesome beer. Definitely check it out. Getting an A for me. It's got everything I like in an IPA, which, you know, it, that's hard to do a lot of the times. It's got a lot of those sweeter notes that I really dig from the New England uh, IPAs. You know, the pineapple, the mango, just massive tropical fruits streaming off this one. But it's got the stuff I like from the West Coast. It's got the bitter dryness. It's got the kind of the pithy citrus fruit. Um, it's super clean and refreshing, which I really enjoy from the West Coast IPAs. So it's got a lot of stuff going on, and it took a lot of the best components of a lot of different IPAs, slammed them into one bottle, and made an absolutely awesome, awesome beer. Well played, again, Carl Strauss on the name and the beer. Awesome stuff. Getting an A from me. Definitely check this one out. Remember, folks, life's too short. Drink amazing beers. Cheers.